Hello and welcome to my Disney Dreamlight Valley. My name is Kate and today I want to bring you on a little tour of my plaza and meadow as an introduction to my channel. I am officially obsessed with this game. I've been playing it every day. I love watching other YouTube videos to get some inspiration so I thought I'd add my valley to the mix. This game is still in early access and I play on my Xbox One through Game Pass, so I don't think my gameplay is as crisp as something you'd see on a PC, but I'm hoping um, that they'll improve that as the game's officially released. Nevertheless, I'm going to show you what I have going on in my valley and my decorating style, and I do have all the characters unlocked, everything's leveled up, and my character's maxed as well. So with that, let's just jump into it. So uh, it's over here next to my plaza, I have a kind of unique setup. I have all these houses kind of smushed together for a more cozy town feel. I have Mickey and Goofy and my house straight ahead. And um, then I have my little workbench area. And I just love having this cozy town feel. I think it's so cute. I haven't really seen anyone else do this. But I love this setup. Nine, and ten times the King Mufasa was. All right, go off. Um, I am really excited to add more houses into the mix here, um, especially if they match this little house. Um, I don't know what to call it, like this little townhouse vibe. Um, over here, I have Merlin. I'm probably going to move him, but he's been crucial to most of the quests, so I put him really close. But he might go back to the forest or, I don't know, maybe up into um, Forgotten Lands. I'm not sure yet. Um, excuse me. So uh, next, I want to show you kind of like the focal point of my plaza. I wanted it to be simple and magical. I changed that middle thing. Um based off of the season. So this last holiday season, I had a Christmas tree there. It was so cute. Um, Woody's house, I did not where to, know where to put this to begin with, um, but I love it here. It's kind of like a um, magical town fair, very Disney World. Um, and then this area is not anything revolutionary. I think a lot of people do this, but you have Shea Remy, Remy's house, and Scrooge's store here and um, they just complement each other so well. Um, I didn't really know what else to do there, but if you have any ideas, let me know. It's just an open kind of plaza space. I wanted it to feel kind of like a little European city. So back here, I did not know what to do with this. You can see the back of the carousel. You can see the back of Scrooge's store. It's kind of ugly, but I wanted a walkway here to go from the forest to the meadow. So um, yeah, that's all I did. I don't really know. If you have any suggestions, please let me know. I keep watching builds and I just cannot figure out what to do with it. So next, I want to take you the whole way over um, to the meadow. And we'll start by going to the center. I do this with every biome. I put the well right in the middle as the focal point. As, um, like, you know, when you're traveling with between wells, um, it is kind of important to get to all these locations. You, you don't want to put it in the middle of nowhere. Um, so I like to put mine right in the middle. Here is Wally's garden. I think a lot of people put theirs here, but I mostly did this because I liked it next to the little pond and I wanted to hide this god awful ugly vehicle. Um, I think I did a pretty good job. Um, let me see here, I'm stuck. Okay. Uh, the rest of the meadow I left very open. It is, I, I mean, it is a meadow, so I wanted it to be more open. I know a lot of people put their house down here because it is a very beautiful location, but I just kind of am leaving it open and maybe I'll do major construction later. I'm not sure. So around the back part here behind Merlin's is the walkway from the Sunlit Plateau. And this is where I put Buzz's house. Um, again, I kind of think it's ugly. I wanted it kind of to feel like you're on a family camping trip and you just kind of stop there as a pit stop or you're camping there. So uh, I do kind of like it. Uh, here is the entrance to the Glade of Trust, which I will show you at another video. So that's about it. That's all I have here. Um, it's, it's a beautiful time of day, so I just kind of wanted to show this to you. This, this is kind of why I like to leave it open because it is so pretty. 
Um, the last thing that I did want to show you, I don't know if this is beneficial to anybody, but the layout from above, um, here is the meadow. You can see I only have those two houses, just Wally and Buzz. And then I have uh, Merlin and Minnie and Mickey and Goofy near my house. And then Woody, Scrooge's shop, and Remy and Shea Remy. So um, that's about it, guys. So thank you for watching my first ever video. I am hoping to do more in the future. I want to, um, you know, get on the updates and keep everybody updated on what's going on maybe do some speed builds especially since we're gonna get mirabelle soon um i would love to i'm hoping we get casita that would be just amazing um so anyway thanks for watching have a lovely day bye